Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So someone asked me to comment on this uh, Jordan Peterson's message to Muslims that he put out this video. I saw it today, about six minutes long. I mean, I found it funny, to be honest. I mean, this condescending, grumpy uh, message that he has for Muslims. It's like you're totally misreading Muslim interest in you, Jordan Peterson. All we want is for you to say La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. That's what we want from you. That's why everyone is meeting with you. That's the only reason why anyone, any of us is talking to you. And you're not doing it. And you don't have anything to say to us that we that we need to listen to. Muslims have been interested to hear what you say about gender and about the LGBT and, and the woke and all those kind of things. Because we, you know, we like to hear people talking about those things with views that are similar to what we have. Because mostly what we hear from the West is just pure insanity. So we're happy to hear someone that's saying things that are close to what we believe. You know, but other than that, you're not in a position to lecture us or to, uh, to advise us or to recommend anything to us or to, certainly not to teach us anything. Uh, nobody's interested, you know. And when you talk about the Abraham Accords, as if these are, uh, as if this is an interfaith religious uh, agreement. You know, we're not talking about the Council of Nicaea here, dude. This is These are agreements between governments. I don't know what you want from the Muslims. These are Arab dictatorships that are making agreements with Israel. This is, these aren't uh, the populations. The The dictators don't care what we think anyway. Are you, th are you thinking about Muslims in America, Muslims in the West? Well, they don't care what we think either. So I don't know who you're talking to. And as far as Jews, we don't have a problem with Jews. We never had a problem with Jews. And don't pretend like our problem with Israel is a problem with Jews. That's that's part of that old, same old thing that we're used to, that if you criticize Israel, then it means you're anti-Semitic. Dude, you've got nothing to say. when he when he when In his message to Muslims, it just shows how pedestrian this man's understanding actually is. And after he's talked to two or three Muslims on his podcast, he thinks now he's uh, given himself credentials to be able to address the Muslims like he's the Khalifa. You Sunnis and Shia. What? Dude. <laughs> it's really a joke. It's really a joke. Nobody needs your help, Jordan Peterson. Go help the, the incels in America. Yeah, assalamu alaikum.